Hi, hello, namaste, my dear friends and students. How are you? I hope you fine. Today I came with a new trick and new video. Today I wanted to discuss with you local super speed VIP question fifth part. I am very happy to say you already I have uploaded super speed VIP questions four parts from locus chapter. Today our question is find the locus of the third vertex of a right angle triangle. The ends of whose hypotenuse are a 0, 6, b 6, 0. It is a right angled triangle means you don't worry it is a very easy. I will explain this question with my neat and cute explanation logic with my magic explanation step by step explanation especially made for you my dear students. It is a highly demanded question from the students. So my dear students, please listen careful. Aims day to success solution. Aims day to success Michita Undaga Mathematics Center by Mendoko Dandaga. Locus chapter right angle triangle question and take by Mendoko Dandaga. My name is Krishna Narati, founder of Panika Reddy Institute of Mathematics and Sciences, Aims Day to Success made in India. Aims Day to Success is not an institution, it is a free service to serve you. Now I am starting a solution. Actually right angle triangle. So you can start draw a right angle triangle and uh, perpendicular value is P and whose ends of the hypotenuse are a b a value is 0 comma 6 next b value is 6 comma 0 now i am as writing assuming value let p x comma y be any point on the locus it is a assuming value for every problem in the locus chapter after that uh, right angle the triangle means uh, from 10th class Pythagoras theorem side square plus side square is equals to hypotenuse square very easy concept it is a logic so listen careful side square p a square plus another side square p b square is equal to hypotenuse square that is a b square so now i am writing one simple formula from 10th class distance formula a b square is x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square by using this concept uh, now I wanted to start a solution my dear students first of all a is uh, 0 comma 6 let it be right uh, x1 y1 b is uh, 6 comma 0 let it be right uh, x2 comma y2 substitute in the formula a b square is equal to x2 value 6 minus x1 value 0 whole square Place y2 value 0 minus y1 value 6 whole square. 6 minus 0 is 6 whole square. Plus 0 minus 6 is minus 6 whole square. a b square is equal to 6 square is 6 x 36. Plus minus to the power even number it become a positive symbol 6 x 36. So 36 plus 36 is 72. a b square ka value 72 agaya. Next to individually you can find P A square and P B square. Now I can write P A square. P is X comma Y. Let it be write it as X2 Y2. Next to A ka value 0 comma 6. You can write it as X1 Y1. Now you can use P A square. I am writing one more time. Distance formula X2 minus X1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so x2 is x minus x1 is 0 whole square plus y2 is y minus y1 is 6 whole square so this can be written as x square 
x minus 0 is x square plus y minus 6 whole square is same. Here one more formula I will write here my dear students a minus b whole square is a square plus b square minus 2ab either a ka value y b ka value 6 substituting x square plus y minus 6 whole square is y square plus 6 square minus 2 into y into 6 this can be written as x square plus y square plus 6 x 36 minus 2 6 12 y it is a p a square value now I can simplify p b square value first of all you can write p x comma y it is x to y2 and b b ka value 6 comma 0 it is x1 y1 now I wanted to find p b square one more time I can write a distance formula x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square here x2 value is x minus x1 value is 6 whole square plus y2 is y minus y1 is 0 whole square so this can be written as x minus 6 whole square plus y minus 0 is y square here i will write formula very easiest formula from 10th class this is in the form of a minus b whole square is a square plus b square minus 2ab either a ka value x b ka value 6 so substitute and simplify we get it x minus 6 whole square is x square plus 6 square minus 2 into x into 6 plus y square so it is x square plus 6 6 36 minus 2 6 12 x plus y square this is a p b square value according to our right angle triangle we are having the formula p a square plus p b square is equals to a b square we got p a square value is x square plus y square plus 36 minus 12 y plus p b square value we got it as uh, x, x square plus 36 minus 12 x plus y square is equals to a b square value we got uh, 72 left side uh, 36 plus 36 uh, 72 so left side 72 right side 72 get cancelled the next value x square plus x square though var 2x square plus y square plus y square though var 2y square next to call x term minus 12x next y term minus 12y is equal to 0 no x value so continue if you wanted to leave it you can leave it otherwise you can take two common two common the remaining value is x square plus y square minus 2 6 are 12 into x minus 2 6 are 12 into y is equals to 0 2 coming into this side uh, 0 by 2 we get x square plus y square minus 6 x minus 6 y is equals to 0 is the equation of the locus I hope you understand my dear students if you satisfy with my explanation please subscribe our channel aims dare to success support with us share to your friends like and comment to this video if you wanted to get like this type of or different type of super speed VIP questions from topic wise subject wise chapter wise so many playlists are there in the description box this description box is in below of this video please go through those all questions i promise you 100 percent uh, of your time will save 100 percent success will come to you a friend in need a friend indeed so please don't forget your friend in your life Joy of sharing is caring and helping. Study is one of the part in your life. So my dear students, please don't neglect your studies in your life. 
प्रैक्टिस मेक्स मैं परफेक्ट प्रैक्टिस कीप्स ए स्टूडेंट टॉप लेवल विदउट पेन यू कॉन्ट गई विदउट लर्न यू कॉन्ट एर्न मार्क्स सो प्रैक्टिस कंपलसरी सो ई विश ऑल द वेरी बेस्ट मीडिया स्टूडेंट्स थैंक यू टेक केयर बाय बाय